shall we? Let's. <laughs> Sir, are Cloud. <laughs> well, Cloud. Do not oh, yank me in like that, bro. Let go. Now, now, when fate sets us a challenge, we must rise to meet it. Are you ready to rumble? What the fuck is this, bro? I love this game. Yeah, it's like eight bit dancing and shit. Wait, huh?
of your fun. While you still have time. Hey. Maybe you should lie down for a bit. No. I'm all right. Come on, man. I know this ain't to see. Why don't you and me go book us some rooms? Fine. <laughs> well, the four of us are off. <laughs> to the wind. Put your trust in others and a last minute twist may pleasantly surprise you. What's this got to do with Sephora? What indeed? Give me another chance. I'll get to this day. Come on. Watch your belongings. Lucky color. Black? Where did I leave? Wait, don't go! <coughs> Third time's a charm! Come on, you stupid thing! Anything the matter? <coughs> Seek and you are sure to find. But alas, you shall forever lose what you cherish most. The star walking walk in mysterious ways. You good? Yeah, it's just what I cherish most. Uh, see what this crap does. My apologies, sir. Than I thought. Yo, swap me over to Zach. <clears throat> swap me over to Zach. Sorry, man. Feel like I failed you. I, I was joking, nigga. Nigga, I was playing. Sorry, man. Feel like I failed you. <laughs> What the fuck? Oh, so I'm 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 this version's cloud. Oh no, never mind. I'm I'm just I'm just Zach in in front of Cloud's perspective. You look good, bro. Seen material like this before. Something about the color. Didn't peg you as a bookworm. Hmm. 
Yeah, you best you best knock it off, bro. You best knock it the fuck off right now, cause Sunny, I I gotta tell you, I'm nut. I'm I'm nothing even just thinking about it. Like what what this what this mm. nigga this timeline crossover Zach lives in this universe shit is about to get crazy. <laughs> Wait, Marlene's already here? Oh yeah, yeah, that's right, that's right. Wait. I'm starving. You're supposed to say thank you. Yes, ma'am. No, you're supposed to say it now. Thank you. This is such a cute scene, but there's no way to Zach knew Marlene. So like, what the, what the fuck? You must mean Biggs. He was just dropping off some food. Then what's with the sneaking around? You've seen those wanted posters all over town? Well, his face is on them. So like in this timeline, everybody else bit the bullet and he survived. Is that what we saw at the end of remake? The different timeline with that Biggs being alive? Crackers. <laughs> Biggs isn't coming back. Tifa isn't coming back. Daddy isn't coming back. Nobody's coming back ever again. <laughs> sure they will. And I know just how to prove it to you. I'll go and get Biggs. Right now. <gasps> mean it? Always do. Honest and true. But <laughs> Let me guess. You don't like dumb rhymes. <laughs> no, I like rhymes sometimes. <laughs> Not bad, kid. Yo, this interaction between Zach and Marlene is just priceless right now. Not bad, kid. No, no, no. Send me back, bruh. Send me back, please. No, bruh. I'm not gonna lie, I don't want go saucer time right now, dude. I really wanna go and see what's up with that. No, bruh, Cloud, hop back into the bed, bruh. Hop back into the bed, cuz. No. <laughs> no. Yeah. Bro, what is this shit? That's you get. Fuck! Fuck! I shouldn't have talked anything. Bro, did you see me get stun locked for like 15 seconds, Brody? Run, run that shit back. <laughs> shit. shit. <laughs> Welcome to Corona Prison. <laughs> now, Cloud, you a first class soldier, and you telling me you got caught off guard by that dude. Hey, boss! Your guests are 
over here! to welcome you to my desert oasis, Cloud. Welcome. Cloud, right? The uh, Merc for Hire? Got it in one, boss man. <laughs> but which one of you is it? Is it you? You? Maybe you? Or is it the pooch? <gasps> I'm just messing with you. That there is our man. I don't think we've met. Of course we haven't met. You got brain damage? I'm not the type of player folks tend to forget. Just look at it. Now, you may not know me, but I know you. And why do you think that is, think? Mr. Mercenary? Mm -hmm. Ha! I'll tell you why. Because it's my business to know. Yeah. And what kind of businessman would I be if I didn't have the scoop on the man who brought down Donnie C? Yeah. Let Please me just say, bravo. It. Well done. We're looking for someone. Hey there, hi there, ho there. No need to explain. Intel's my bread and butter. Really gotta tell you twice? Uptown secrets always trick it down. Which is why I'm ever so certain that you'll be useful. What do you want? So the son of a bitch with a gun for an arm? I got him under lock and key. Out in the middle of the woods. Now, I'm a generous guy, so I'd be happy to tell you where to find him. But only if I get a little something from you first, understand? That little something being a shitload of money. I want stacks of it, heaps of it, mountains of it. I mean, did you hear what he did? Your buddy shot Shinra troopers in broad freaking daylight. So I ain't about to give him up for free. You think my prison runs on good deeds? No, sir. It runs on guilt. So much so goddamn guilt. God So yeah, Gil, that's what I want. And relax, I know you don't have it on you, but I got an idea on how you can scrape some together. I'm entering you and one lucky chocobo in the races, and you are gonna win. <laughs> on that note, until you bring home the bacon, I'm gonna hold on to your pigs. Help us out. Hey, chill out, kiddo. We'll take excellent care of you. Unless you fail to deliver, in which case, well, let's just say, there are plenty of other ways to raise the funds on the quad. Can put a price on anything. Ah, uh -uh. that's Gus to you. Got that, jockey boy? As for all those pesky race details, talk to Garth here. I got you, boss man. Don't let me down, huh? Later. All right, Mr. Merc, let's go meet your bird. <laughs> Better stick close, you hear? <laughs> well, this is a fine state of affairs. You will get us out of here, won't you, Cloud? <laughs> <laughs> Why he punch Doom, bro? What did Doom do? <laughs> Why did Gus punch him, bro? And here I thought that Gus guy was just yanking our chain. Same. That said. Is it okay to let them Is Elena eating sea salt ice cream? Is that what I'm seeing? I think that's what I'm seeing. So I fact checked this, and this is 100% a Kingdom Hearts reference. I love you, Square. Deploying riot control armor. That nigga took out his own fucking helicopter, bruh. Oh! oh! Wait, wait, wait a second. Wait a second, stop. Nigga. 
Stop fucking playing with me, bro. So then, like, the, the thing is, what is what is Zach's significance in this shit? What is my role, bruh? Am I just here to help fix the timeline that I'm dead again? Because if so, brother, I, I, I gotta be honest with you, that's pretty garbage. I'm not dying for the plot again, bro. Biggs. <laughs> There's our man. I wonder how Zach greeted him. He's probably like, "Yo, hey, what's up? Don't know if you were looking for anybody, but uh, I was looking for you." Bro, they keep giving me little bits and pieces of Zach. It's fucking killing me, bro. Ah, uh, it's cute how Kate sits riding on Tifa's lap, though. I, I think that makes up more than makes up for it. Come on, bro. She doesn't do no physical attacks, so why would you give me ones that are based off of physical attacks? That doesn't make any fucking sense, bro. This nigga don't stop fucking running from me, bro. Okay. Bro, I'm gonna be so fucking pissed. It's not happening. Bro, come on, Aerith. Gotta cut out a Rufus over there, bro. You fucking traitor. Now that all the renovations are complete, I think it's time that we peace out. What? Don't worry. You got this, Johnny. Johnny? You don't need us anymore, Johnny. You've got you. Johnny! Bruh. <laughs> Johnny's! <laughs> Space to show off your collection. I 
I'd love to showcase any rare or interesting artifacts you happen to come across, and rest assured you'll be handsomely rewarded for it. I've got my heart set on becoming the best in the business. You know where to bring them. The fuck is in there, Johnny? Is that where the drugs are? Don't start saying this crisis core shit, bro. Don't don't start. Don't start this crisis core shit, man. Young, young man. Oh, we're officially on Gongaga territory, nigga. Listen, go. You can't jump from there, cloud. I ain't worried about it because I wanted these boxes anyway. I wanted those boxes anyway. Ha! Eat that. Maybe our lucky food will be on the menu. What what lucky food? <gasps> lucky food! I think she's talking about y'all too, bro. Run! Oh, uh, oh! Uh. Are these? They are. Good Gaga mushrooms. Oh, uh, we're here. They may be hard to come by in Midgar, but here, here you can't move for the blasted things. Wow. Hmm. Whoa, calm down, bro. Calm down, bro. Oh, oh! Bro, it's Sissonay! Oh my fucking god, it's Sissonay, bro! Oh my god! Wait, 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 wait! Oh my god, bro, it's Sissonay! Yo! Wait, time out, bro. Time out, cuz I'm on my hands and knees in my room, bruh. <laughs> Cincinnati is here! Wait a second. Wait a second. Are we gonna learn her real name? Is she about to drop her real fucking name? Has she been there in Final Fantasy VII, the original? We just never saw her. She was just a regular character. Bruh. Bruh. Closure. Composer, bro. I did a home off. Yo. Yo, I did a lot of jumping around just now, bro. I'm 24 and it's starting to start. I'm starting to feel that shit, bro. Fuck. Oh, on top of that, I just peeked. Oh my gosh, she recognizes Cloud, bro. I just rewatched the footage. Nigga, she knows who Cloud is. Bro, this is okay. Okay, so, slow it down. Calm down. Hold on, bro. Sister Day knows exactly who Cloud is, bro. So she's like, you. Why? Oh, I thought you were somebody else. No, she knows exactly who this man is. Bruh, hold on, bro. Y'all niggas know exactly who each other are. Cicely would be familiar with Reeve because she's part of the Turks. Welcome to Gungaga. Or was. I'm Cicely, Coalition. Oh! And sorry, didn't mean to startle you before. Just doing our jobs. Back to your posts. Does any does does it? Y'all, I'm about to anybody hear the Price of Freedom remix in the back room, bro. Yo, this game is fucking amazing. You'll get a clear view of the reactor from that hill. Make sure to pay your respects, though. Of course. <laughs> Come on. My heart can't take it. My heart can't take it. Just listen to this, bro.
telling you right now is I know we in chapter nine and like story wise, not a lot of shit has happened. And I already know what is about to happen. We they we literally about to soup up. We're about to soup up. What if I didn't want to go that way, baby? What if I wanted to grab some items first in case there's a boss battle right over that hill, over yonder? Crazy, man. But yeah, bro, the story's ramping up. Oh my God. The story's ramping up or is about to start ramping up and it's about to get fucking crazy, bro. We're talking pacing wise, the Final Fantasy Rebirth struggling just, just, just a tad bit. Cause the thing about Midgar was that everybody had like, well, just, Everybody had their own shit going on, but it was all in a condensed spot. It wasn't the open, vast world, you know what I'm saying? So you would see a nigga from five chapters ago pop back up and he has some serious shit that was either connected to the plot or one of the characters connected to the plot. You did. This is just like everybody has their own like really monumental story, but it's condensed a little bit smaller because everybody else has to have a vast. It's a vast world, so everybody has to have their own little thing but it's not as focused, you know what I'm saying? It's not in that same environment where everything is getting affected by another. Of course, it's the world, but everything that's happening in Midgar has probably taken a while, you know, even them getting to calm, it's taken a while for them to get over there, you know, to reach over to these other parts of the world, to reach over to, to Wu Tai and then Cosmo Canyon and then Costa del Sol and Gongaga. So, yeah, bro. The pace is, 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 is not bad, let me say that. It's not bad, but it could, it could be, you know, a little bit more hype. But here's the thing, though, if it's not spaced out, you know what it you know what it strikes me as all of it's about to be condensed in like three chapters where shit's going to be just happening back to back to back to back. And like, I'm cool with that. But I did want a little bit more, but I'm still super hyped because the game up here was was still really fucking good, a little tedious with the world intel and whatnot. But overall, like that's just that's just people say that's padding. That is a little padding, but I would like to know more about you know, um, the world of Final Fantasy, because back in the original, like you didn't get this much type of like exposure. None of these things had like voice actors, you know, all these beautiful environments. So it's just more fleshed out. So you can consider it padding with the, the Intel and the Fiend and all that. But all in all, that's just a package to get you the feel and the in the merciness of Final Fantasy VII's world. So that's fine. But uh, yeah, uh, I'm not going to sugarcoat it. We're getting to like Kingdom Hearts three levels of like in game shit where it's just shit happening back to back to back to back to back to back to back. And I'm here for that shit, dog. Homie, I'm going to cry. I'm going to cry if this is if this is his grave. Sister, please, man, don't do this to me. Listen to this new remix. Ah, this game fucking amazing. Hmm? Hmm? Uh, yeah, yeah, Yuffie, just just follow along. Thank you. So what is this? Three years ago, the reactor here suffered a catastrophic failure. It was old, and couldn't he handle the stress. It needed maintenance, which Shinra never provided. And then one day... So, they're cheap as well. Huh. This was the company's way of trying to... make amends. I'm surprised they even made the effort. And thanks to the hard work of our people, Gongaga rose from the ashes, right? <laughs> That's nice and all. But one memorial doesn't buy absolution. You guys must be tired. I know you've got things to do, but if you wanted to rest up... Wouldn't they say no? My house is just down there. Got an open door policy, so feel free. Woohoo! Don't mind if I do! I'm, uh, gonna take a look around. Aerith, we know exactly what you about to do, baby. Come back. Seriously, get some rest, okay? She knows. She knows about me. You know about me, don't you? Yeah, you know about me. You know about me, but you don't want to say it in front of my friends because you're scared. You're scared it might make me trip off the perkies and then you'd be 100% right there, baby. But guess what? Today, bro, I, I'm still trying to wrap my head around it, bro. Sis, 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 sis,
Sis, I need to stop. I'm sorry. <laughs> Fuck, I should have looked at the damn mushrooms when I had the chance. They kind of look like these. Right ones. Correct. Oh. What the f yo 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 red you said something and like your 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 lips was moving but nothing came out of your mouth. All right, man, I gotta prepare myself because I feel like I'm a tear up being in this month this MF, bro. I ain't trying. I ain't trying to have y'all hear me cry. It's ugly. <laughs> All right, composure. Oh, Cloud. Friend of yours? Come in. Please. Hmm. Your eyes. You're a soldier, aren't you? Um, was. You wouldn't happen to know our son, would you? Zach? <sighs> Are you all right? Fine. What did you say his name was? Zach. Zach Fair. Oh my god, no pulsating. Zach? You know him! Sorry, no. Cloud, you lie! Our son just up and left one day, determined to chase his dreams. At first, he wrote us all the time, but... When I first saw you, I thought, maybe this is the girl he was always talking about. Sorry if I made you feel uncomfortable. I doubt I was the only woman in his life. Charming guy like Zack. <sighs> <laughs> Wherever he is, I hope he's enjoying himself at least. They do say no news is good news, right? They sure do. Say, if you do happen to see Zack, would you tell him that we miss him? And to please get in touch. Of course I will. Fuck. We should probably be heading back, don't you think? What? Already? At least have something to eat before you go. Thanks, but we don't want to keep our friends waiting. <laughs> Another time then. is making an almighty comeback for the plot i don't know how i feel about it though low-key but you know what to see my man back in action and moving around you think i'm going you think I, look at me look at me y'all think i'm going to deny that bro that wasn't very nice of me You remember me telling you about Zack, right? At the playground? How he was my first love? Yeah. This is where he grew up. And now that I'm here, it's... a lot. So when I saw someone who looked like him, I don't know. I had to say something. Didn't even occur to me to think how they would feel about it. Pretty selfish, huh? Waltzing in there, stirring up memories. You're too hard on yourself. Bet it was good for them to get it all out. I hope you're right. So, this Zack guy, you still like him? <laughs> wow, you went there, huh? Maybe. He's never given me a reason not to.
Any news? Nothing. No calls, no letters. Tifa knows about Zack, damn it! Leaving you out in the cold like this? Forget about that loser. What? Cloud did not just say that. Yeah, like what the fuck? Right? Then I hate to break, hate to break it to you. But if he's been gone this long, the man is dead. Oh, Cloud. Sorry. I'm going to go lie down. Well, that clears that up. He definitely doesn't know who Zack is. <sighs> Another time. He straight up called Cloud. He straight up called the bleh. He straight up called Cloud or Zach a loser. Oh my goodness, bro. You just hurt her feelings. What am I standing on? What the fuck? Nah, bruh.
What the fuck? Hey, Pyle, what? Pyle, what is you doing, bro? Why is you fighting like him? Ugh, he got a saucy though. Hold on. That's that. That's some Genova sales. That Sephiroth confidence. Yes, sir. Her prey. Cloud, you tripping balls right now, Brody. Don't do this. But I'm no fool. Why wouldn't you just dodge in that scenario, Tifa? Like, do the little flip thing, jump, skip, hop. Now we're fucked up. Oh my god, brother. Fuck. Yo, what the fuck? A drift in the void of time. This bridge is make fast. Who are you? Certainly, you're not throwing me a Gilgamesh boss fight. I saw it 
plain, and never does my judgment err. So it comes to this! What was that? 